Welcome to this video showing the insert cables and pipe steps in Rockstick Transit Designer. There are two modes to insert cables and pipes. The first one I'll show you is the estimate mode. In the estimate mode, you input your cable diameter, an optional category, and the amount of cables. To add other categories, click Add Row. This is all you need to do, and then just go to the next step. If you want to insert pipes, click on the Pipes tab. You can use either cables or pipes, or both. You can also use Detail Mode, and if I press Detail Mode, you can see that the form now transformed to somewhat of an Excel grid. Some additional fields also appear, like the ID, the name, and the type. The idea behind this is that you can take an Excel spreadsheet that could be an extract from a system or a manual made and just copy and paste using the control V command. Now browsers typically don't allow you to use the right click menu so you have to use your keyboard shortcut. If you don't know your keyboard shortcut you can press this button to get some help. If there's an error in the list, like a missing ID that is now mandatory, that cell will be marked red. Putting your mouse over that cell will also tell you what's wrong with it. ID is mandatory. When you have no errors in the list, you can see that the button to go to the design step is now enabled. Click this to go to the next step. That's all for the Insert Cables and Pipe Step in Transit Designer. Thank you for watching.